Hello everybody, welcome to my channel Family Camp Tents and to my site with the same name. Today I have an interesting tent from Quest brand. It is uh, with the name Switchback 8 person cross vent dome tent. Here is the picture of the tent with the fly on so you can see how it looks. And here it is without the fly to better understand its structure and why they call it a dome tent. Actually it is an extended dome tent so you have the main two poles here and two loops on the sides that uh, create extensions. And here is the view from the narrow side so you can uh, even better understand that this is a sort of a dome uh, type tent. It is moderately tall, 188 centimeters, and uh, with, with a partial coverage fly, which you have seen here. The, the fly has interesting uh, features. There are zippers here on the narrow side, so you can unzip it and then have views uh, to these two sides and extra uh, air circulation. Uh, they have added two poles for the fly alone, so one of them creates two brims, one here and one on the other opposite side, and the other one is here for uh, underneath the fly where you have those zippers. So with these brims you actually have a sort of dry uh, access, dry uh, entry point, uh, and uh, the brims partly protect the window that is on the door, on the upper part of the door, and the window that is on the opposite side. But when you see the, the tent from the narrow side, you realize that these brims are not really uh, so prominent. And they, uh, I have seen people complaining that when you open the door and it rains, the rain goes inside. So it's a pity that these brims are not uh, deeper than you would have a proper um, dry access to the tent. This is the view inside, so you have one separate door, uh, window, sorry, with, with a mesh and a zippered panel. So this is the view from the door. And on the sides, as I mentioned, you have these zippers that you can open, and in this case you have uh, views and also air circulation from all sides and my guess is uh, this is uh, what uh, why they included the, the phrase uh, cross vent in the official name of this tent. Regarding the materials this is uh, fiberglass quite typical uh, for such budget uh, tents and not only for budget tents you can find fiberglass poles even in very expensive tents. Uh, so there are six of them shock corded easy to use Everything is standard. Note that you have a manual inside of the uh, of the carry bag, so this can be useful for people who have no experience with such tents. There are of course stakes. They are J, uh, J shape, simple stakes, uh, and guidelines are included as well. So everything is there to use the the tent. The fabric is polyester, uh, the fly and the walls, and the floor is polyethylene. The waterproof rating of the uh, fly is 800 millimeters. This is not much, but in most cases you don't really need more. Uh, for the floor they don't give uh, any rating, but this is a thick polyethylene, so you should be safe from the groundwater. They, make this tent in three different colors, colors. so this is the, the red version and you have seen this is uh, turquoise, uh, green, whatever you call it, and the blue one that you have seen here. Really great colors. Uh, regarding the carry bag, this is how it looks. Uh, the tent is quite compact for its overall size. The carry bag is a zipper, you have straps to carry it short distances. Regarding the setup, one person can do this easily, let's say maximum 20 minutes or so. It's easier when you have two people. 
there are sleeves uh, on the on the canopy and i have seen some people complaining about uh, uh, the fact that the, the 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 poles can dislodge when you pull them through the sleeves but the actually trick is that you shouldn't uh, pull them you should actually uh, uh, push the the poles through the sleeves and this holds for any any tape uh, any tent because if you try to pull them then they will dislodge uh, no matter how high quality tent it, it can be uh, regarding ventilation uh, the the phrase cross vent is there because of those uh, opening openings on all sides you have seen the tent without the the fly so there is a lot of mesh areas on the canopy vapor can escape and when the sky is clear of course uh, you will not have uh, problems uh, with uh, condensations you can open it and have air from all four sides but um, when it rains you have to close everything and in such uh, situations you would want to have uh, floor vents but uh, the tent is without them here and it's a it's a pity uh, a, a bit about the the best use and users the tent is officially for eight people and you have a, a bit more than 10 square meters or 112 square feet so in the case of eight people this would be 14 square feet or 1.3 square meters not much they determine the capacity by the number of uh, sleeping paths that you can put on the floor indeed dimensions are, are such that you can put eight paths on the floor but this is a backpacking principle for determining the capacity for real camping this is a tent for maximum four or five people this is a camping tent and uh, you certainly wouldn't want to have eight people inside Regarding uh, seasons and climate, I see this as a tent for the warmer part of the year. And uh, the waterproof rating is not high, it's uh, only 800 millimeters, but reality is that you don't need more. So it will work well in normal situations, but I wouldn't go to windy places with such a tent because of those brims and uh, partial coverage fly i don't think it would last long in very windy places regarding the weight i would describe it as moderately uh, light because you have it is below uh, 10 kilograms and the the floor area is over 10 square meters and uh, this is actually a lightweight tent but of course you wouldn't want to carry it uh, anywhere long distances from the car this is a car camping tent my overall rating for this tent is quite high but i use the same rating criteria for all of them so you can easily compare my true complaint uh, cons are uh, that there, there are no floor vents and there are complaints about weak seams i have seen them quite a number by uh, users but on the other hand this is a light vent lightweight and compact tent, uh, very easy to use and incredibly affordable. If you don't want to spend a lot and uh, want to have a tent for occasional use with your family or with your friends, then uh, this could be a good option for you. Thank you for watching. Uh, please follow the link below the video so you can come here to the site and read this text in detail. And, uh, Please subscribe to my channel and give me a like if you find this presentation useful.